flashing light bulbs and awkward angles in Sonic Adventure DX. I am Prey Scooter, along with Jacob Let's Plays, doing Big Side Story. Tell you how? And how'd this egg get out here? I'm, I'm throwing it up there. Back where it belongs. Yeah, so, step on this switch to open it, and head on into Big's final stage. The hot shelter. That's right, only, only took... Uh, what, four levels, thank god. Fish phone, catch buggy. The Dog, you're not pro providing helpful commentary. <laughs> uh, what is it? Damn it, no. Doug, if you got nothing to say, then don't speak. Well, it, well, this stage is actually a bit more interesting because this actually has a bit of a, you know, a run, run and jump segment for Big before he has to fish for Froggy. I know, it's... and now he's booking it. Now he's booking it. He's got the shoe power up. He's booking it. Oh my God! Oh bless you, Sega. You're trying so hard. At least, maybe by this point, they're acknowledging that people want to do more than just fish. Anyway. Oh, there we go. Cutscene. And Big's in the bubble. <laughs> I'll just patiently wait for my end to catch up. Oh, there we go. Almost. Looks like the frog needs my help. And Eggman keeps a switch that drains his pool in the middle of said pool. Drains it? No, fill it up. Fill it up. Big has no way out. Well, drains, fills, it kind of does that. Same thing. Alright, water's in. Now the Flipper Froggy. Thought Froggy. Yeah, yeah. I think. I'm trying to remember if the lure I have right now is the best one you can get for Big or the second best. Knowing me, my infinite pointless Sonic knowledge, I'd probably know, but I don't care enough about Vig to, to inform you on that, so sorry. But you know, as, as much as, you know, at least post-recording or talking to other people on Skype, I've bitched a lot about this, but I don't know, I, I, at least I can bear to watch it. Yeah, because you, well, you don't have to sit through and suffer the playing part of it. Okay, there you are, Froggy. Alright, Froggy, now we're gonna do this nice and civil. Get on my freaking pole. That's what I say to girls, and then I get arrested. Because you ask them very bluntly. In fact, uh, you know, I don't know the girl before I ask them, but. <clears throat> Yay, done. Jesus Christ, man. I really don't think Big is like a poorly designed gameplay style, Not just out of place and unneeded. Hey guys. Oh yeah, so I forgot to mention something I should probably mention. Every Sonic character gets it gets at least one flashback. Oh to the Echidna tribe. Yep. So this means that yes, even Big is going back in time. That's strange. Oh god. Uh, big, big, big to the future. Yeah. Get it? It's like Back to the Future, but with big. Ha ha ha. Flux capacitor. Fluxy. <laughs> what the hell is a gigawatt? <laughs> anyway. So go ahead and run up to the little <coughs> small orange kid now that it's hiding amongst these, se these several shinies. He's what now? Who knows? The orange echidna hiding amongst the shiny emeralds. Oh, okay. Wow. Like I say, the cutscenes only just started for me. Right for me well, again, I, I I've seen it enough times, I believe. Is it alright for me to be here? Drip, 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 drip. So do you Go away. Trust me. <laughs> no, so I don't. Please, please leave. I, I do kind of like how, unlike in Sonic Adventure 2, the villain for this game, you know, Chaos, actually has a backstory. Unlike um, the 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 final hazard who just came out of friggin' nowhere and shoved a giant cannon up its ass. I am an ultimate boss. Poof. The servers are the seven yeah, and how the hell is that giant lizard Shadow the Hedgehog's prototype? Go from a giant lizard to a small hedgehog, I... 
It's like that's SA2. This is SA1. You can hear me bitch about that in my LP. Shameless plug. L shameless plug. Uh, don't worry. I'll probably be slinking to your channel in, in the comments. Hell yeah. But in didn't um. I've not actually read them, but I've heard in the Archie comics, didn't Knuckles actually come from the same era as the flashbacks take place? But like it was like, like frozen in time or something like that? I don't know, I never read the Archie comics. Shaking ship. If something happens now, there's no point to my rescuer do. I don't know Ship's about to go so down. Close. Oh, puns. I see what you did there. Don't do it to me. We better get going, buddy. <laughs> oh. oh, of all people, you think you know a guy? Let me say something like that. Resuming monorail operation. Yay, monorail's operating. Do, you oh yeah. Mm. So I mean, to ask, ask you to relate to the viewers. Have you noticed any differences between the U.S. version and the uh, uh, European version of this game yet? Um, but like I said, I've not really completed big story but out of you know everything I have seen like the hope worlds and the and you know all, all these little tidbits there really are no differences huh. but in I, I believe since we're mentioning the differences in um, the mega collection version of Sonic 1 the music actually slowed down in our version for whatever reason which is kind of an annoyance when I say kind of I mean really an annoyance but I digress yeah. all right so ride this elevator up, and then we're gonna go, and we're gonna go to the middle of the place with the fish chaos. Except I missed oh the my jump. Goodness. We're gonna finish this here and now, god damn it! I would like you to come down, elevator. I want to go fail this jump once more. Yeah, I, I just saw that. That was, to put it bluntly, pathetic. There we go. Hi, big fishy. Whoa, I was that in any what is that giant fish case in any other character's story? Yep, that's Chaos Four. There was no was oh yeah that yeah, yeah. Yeah, you fight him with three different characters in this yeah, game. Sonic Tales, yeah, in Sonic Tails and Knuckles in the river. So in in the pond even. Yep. Yeah, not, yeah, now that it's I, I actually see it out of it's actually a pretty cool designed boss. In terms of appearance. <laughs> but of course, now we get a giant spider instead. Yes. Anyway, ah, uh, what is it? So Eggman just approached Big, said you're not, and said you're not going to get away. Eggman, until two seconds ago, you didn't know what Big looked like. And now he knows his life just got a whole lot worse. And frogs puking up Emer Chaos Emeralds is awesome. Oh hey, now I'm just about in sync with you. Happy joy. Well, anyway, in the Sonic X adaptation of this, I believe uh, Sonic and Knuckles were the ones to come in and uh, kick Chaos's ass for Big while Big ran back and forth screaming. That's, pro that's actually probably an accurate depiction, actually. Except for the fact that in this game, besides the frog that's jumping on air, is the Chaos falls froggy to get his tail back. Oh yeah, yeah. But um, on a somewhat unrelated note, after this, I'll mention it now since I probably won't be able to say it at the right time. But after this, you'll see some of the most poorly designed cutscene ing ever. It's like Biggs holding Froggy, like swinging him back and forth. Like when his hands move left, Froggy moves right, and they just keep going through each other. It's just one of the worst things in any Sonic game. You'll know what I mean when you see it. Yeah, yeah, I haven't seen it for a while, so I'll make sure to keep an eye out for it. And well, let's see. Uh, I made a noopsie. I actually forgot one of Big's power-ups throughout this. Oh well. Oh well, maybe. I know. I suppose if someone asks in, asks in the comments, you'd always send him a like drop a reply. I suppose. Well, you don't even need to get all the power-ups. In fact, the one I found on the ice level was a little too much to even get to make to. Complete the game. 
In fact, I don't even think you need any power of whatsoever to be a big story. No, I don't think any of them are required, and I just said... I, I, I just said people would comment asking about Big, and no, that's just dumb. No one wants to know anything about Big because he sucks. Got him. Got him. Wait, you already got him? Yeah. Shortest boss fight ever. It is... Even short in the first fight with... This, this hasn't gone up yet, but did you do the, like... Um, you know that Eggman boss with Sonic with the big drill on it? Yep. That you fight in the Mystic Ruins? Did you do the glitch? Which glitch we just that? keep, we just keep tapping him, he keeps coming and tapping him, and you kill him in one pass. Oh, I didn't know about that glitch. I'll have to try it out someday. Yeah. <laughs> it's awesome. All right. And I didn't even watch to see the bad cutscene animation. But I, I think, well, right there, at least for me, I posted a comment saying if I said it the right time, but right there, that was pretty bad as well. All right. So, guess how big gets off the ship? <laughs> oh, I remember this is. Oh, it's hilarious. That's open he jumped, but... That's somehow not giving him enough credit. Ace? Or not Ace, uh, Big. The Ace Fighter Pilot. <laughs> There's just that one shot of him just scrolling past in the plane that's like five times smaller than he is. Yeah, he's like, he's, he's hanging on by the control stick that he's driving by. Watch this. I just wait for mine to catch up, and if and if I laugh at nothing, then you'll know why. <laughs> I just noticed there was um some Japanese kanji on the egg carrier. Oh, I totally missed it. And this is how Big Story wraps up. Big Big looks into the sky like a hero. All because he <laughs> saved his big frog. Story wrap up? How does Big Story wrap up? Not too soon, that's how. Wait, what? I mean, not soon enough. I don't know. But as I've said, this music, Junson, you're just going crazy on his guitar. Don't get much better than that. Yeah. You know, I wouldn't be surprised if he's actually working in an 88 steel string guitar right now. One of those ones that are like a flat bench. I'm no guitar expert, but oh yeah, it's basically yeah, just I like agree. It, yeah, it's just a steel a, it's a steel guitar as well as ones that's not upright like a normal guitar. It's just a flat bench guitar that plays the same. I think it's that is there's some videos on YouTube of him um, uh, playing the instrumental versions of some of his favorite Crush Forty songs, like he does "Live and Learn," "I Am All of Me," and "Night of the Wind," I believe. Well, anyway, uh, I'm not gonna go through the whole credits, but this is this is the end of Big Story, everyone. Uh, Jacob from Jacob Let's Plays, I do thank you for joining me in today's adventure, endeavor, whatever you want to call it. And I will come to your house and find you and kill you for making me th sit through this waste of life and waste of gameplay. But thank you all for watching. Yep, and tune in, and tune in next time for more yelping dog and gamma story. <laughs>